against the Hawks to start out. Let's check out Chicago's starting lineup. Ball and Levine are the guard set. Vucevic is out there at the Rosen, and it's Santos in at the three spot. Great to watch Trey Young set plays up on a nightly basis. Ball against Young. Ball with the bucket. And I'll bet that's what they talked about before the game, getting the ball inside early. And so it's Murray with it. He brings it up for the Atlanta Hawks. Outside Griffin. Three-pointer. And it's MP with the rebound. A moment now to hear from our sideline reporter, Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. David. Well, Kevin, I got a few minutes with Billy Donovan. He's looking for his guys to put up a terrific performance tonight, especially at the defensive end. He said, we want to use our length and athleticism to protect the rim, and make it hard for shooters to get clean looks. This is the first meeting of the season between these two. Guys, we'll see how it comes out. Well, David, thank you. We'll be looking for the defensive-minded approach coming in, Greg. I like that they're focused on getting stops. Gives them the opportunity to turn that defense into offense. And let's see how good they can be in transition to get out and try to find some easy ones. Now, here's MP. After the miss from Trey Young, it's good. And boy, did he ever sell the pump fake. Worked to absolute perfection. In this offensive system, breath at the Hawks run, it allows for a lot of creativity. Yeah, lots of dribble handoffs at the top Ball of the game. Ball 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 afraid to attack mismatches, and this is the type of offenses that I think a lot of players would enjoy playing. For Chicago, they've gotten their first three shots to go in for them to start off this game. Vucevic is screen on Griffin. Here's Santos and the dunk by MP. And credit the screen for giving him the space he needed to get to the rim. For sure, GA allows him to come in with the sledgehammer. Yeah, why well, he settle for the layup when you can attack the rim and rise up like that. Here's Collins after the Bulls pick up two. Capella with a screen on Levine. The Hawks again can hit. I know it's about defending the post and the three-point line these days, but still got to be active in the mid-range area, and the defense gets away with one there. And now you see them starting to really work the ball inside. Hawks have gone just one of four to get this game started. This is it to Capella. Young up top. He's covered by Ball. Stolen by Ball. MP outside. That falls. Nice feed that time from Ball. And it's six points for MP. Oh, this is the kind of start they were hoping for. Collins passes it to Young. Capella with a screen on Ball. Young's shot is off. And here are the Bulls now. It's a 12-2 run here. Good pace. Ball with the bucket. Ball's got his second basket of the night. And it just seems that every pass they make is leading to a score. Just great ball movement. You know, Greg, we talk a lot about balls. Positional size. outside. Hey, you want these kind of nights where you can start to see those openings before they happen. Collins and Capella man the post position. It's the guard pair, the talented Young and Murray. And it's Griffin in at the small forward. They're the group for Nate McMillan starting the second half. Well, you got to slow him down. If he gets ahead of speed like that and measures those steps, Bonzo's going to throw it down. Murray looking around. In the corner, it's Griffin. Outside, Cohen. Beyond the arc. And Vucevic pulls it down. Vucevic has got four rebounds now tonight. They have been board dominant in this game. That's definitely been a factor in crafting this huge lead. It's a great move, and he catches the defense completely off guard. Well, just ripping through right there as he finds the open spot. 
and gets right through their high basketball IQ play. Griffin shot is off. Chicago dictating the flow. They haven't given up any points here in the second half. Next up for them, the Knicks coming out here to play. That game marks the first half of a quick two-game homestand. Here's DeRozan. Good in the assist goes to MP. MP's got four assists in the game. The defense not putting up any fight on the inside. They've allowed 10 straight points in the bank. Collins a screen on ball. And once again off the mark by Atlanta. Not been an easy start. Three straight misses here on these possessions. And what makes Chicago tricky to defend, Kevin, they just have such a balanced attack. They can score in the paint from mid-range or hurt you from deep. And everything is dropping for them. Terrific second half run. Well, with the confidence growing, that's one thing. But they seem to be getting more intense, and that's helping the quality of their play here. Capella sends a screen for Murray over Levine. Capella, and it's put back up and in by Capella. Capella's got his first two points of the night. And they get one now. One of five here in the third. And now we've got some time to check in from the sideline. You got for us, D.A.? Thanks very much. Now, some people call John Collins John the Baptist for how he dunks over defenders. He says, the game is slowing down for me. I'm able to see my spots. I want to continue to build on that and be looked at as a pillar, a guy that can do counted upon. Kevin, it seems he's hungry for more. Back to you. He's a big-time dunker, that's for sure, looking to reach his full potential. David, thanks. Here's Vucevic. And no good that time. And Atlanta will go the other way. You know, as the Bulls have become a more veteran team, Greg, it feels like they've settled in to what they do well. And you need a strong identity to be successful in this league. Chicago is building towards that, but it does take time. Here's Santos and a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two. The Bulls have been perfect at the line so far, but three of just two for two. With an almost entirely new group. Andre Drummond's checked in for Vucevic. Green comes in for DeMar DeRozan. Alex Caruso is checked in for Levine. And it's Dosumu in for ball. A three from Bogdanovich. Rebound Andre Drummond. Well, they've been better than good on the glass today. And there is a glaring discrepancy between these two teams in that area. Yeah, I'd say that shot is well within his range. <laughs> I would hope so. <laughs> Guys, they're looking for a way to score here. Yeah, they've had a tough time taking the lid off. Okonwu. Well, Bogdanovich would prefer to shoot it, but teammates so wide open, had to give it up. The Bulls have gone 5 of 7 from the field in the third quarter. Let's see if they can keep it up. MP, good. 21 points for MP. Caruso. And Matador defense. That's one of the easiest shots he is ever going to see. Yeah, feels like Christmas right now, just gift wrapping points. Bogdanovich, no luck. Chicago with the ball. They're on a 14 to 4 run. Now, here's Dosumu. Defense right on him. Feeds it to Green. Over Kaminsky. And it's Green missing. Uh, nobody getting a hand in his face in that painted area. That's a miss he's going to be disappointed with. Holiday dishes to Rondo. Here's the triple. It's Drummond with the rebound. Drummond's got six rebounds now in the game. Now here's Dosumu. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. Santos plays it up off the glass. Love his shot selection. Good at taking quality shots. Whether he's defended or open, he knows how to knock those down. And so it's the Chicago Bulls with a major three. 16. The Bulls, 55. will get the first possession and now the opening lineup for Chicago 
Ball runs point with Levine flanking him. Nikola Vucevic is out there with DeMar DeRozan. And it's MP in at the three, a small forward. Goes up from the block. And he gets the bucket. Now Murray. He's been a big scorer for this offense, averaging around 20 points a game. And here's Young. Collins with a screen on ball. Young misses. Ball passes to MP. First quarter of play, a minute in. The three from ball. Counted from distance. Good instincts from Nicola. Finding the open man. Smitty, this Hawks team, they'll take what you give them on offense. They are comfortable working in the mid-range. B.A., they can attack at all three levels. No agenda and are flexible with their looks. What a defensive play. Gets the stop and does it without fouling. To the paint. And MP gets it to go. On the assist by DeRozan. Mr. MP's got his second basket on the night. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Here's Young. And it's Capella with the jam. You gotta love how Capella keeps possessions alive. Really nice effort right there. Here's the pick. Pass to Vucevic. The three is up. And again, it's the Bulls from deep. You see the game plan is working already. Four straight makes to start this one. Murray passes to Young. They get it back. And that one's good with extra effort on the glass. Great positioning by Trey Young. He's right there to collect the rebound and send it back. Here's MP. And count the basket. He was. Free throw good. MP. Oh, guys, the city of Chicago is used to the highest standard. The shadow of those Michael Jordan teams still looms large. Now here's Young. 33 points last game. Here's Murray. Oh, it's blocked by Levine. You see the quickness and focus of Levine. Tracks the shot, shuts it down. They played with fantastic energy from the opening tip. Already ahead by double digits, trying to run away and not look back. It feels like once you get a taste of winning, you never want that to end, Grant. But the reality is, for most franchises, it does end for long periods of time. I hope the fans do appreciate this current Bulls team. There's something to be proud of. Now here's Young. He's putting up some terrific numbers, over 28 a game. And they may have talked about shot selection coming into this. Griffin against MP. Capella with the defensive effort. The Hawks trailing. Pass to Murray. Over MP. Murray, no good. That's a shot he'd like back. He's usually going to make those. Here's MP. Second chance shot. Here's Vucevic. Oh, a beautiful reverse layup. Vucevic has got five. <laughs> and the Hawk. For the Bulls. Establishing a paint presence early in the game. It really helps and pays big dividends down the line because it frees up your perimeter. And from the jump, they've also clearly been focused on running effective plays here tonight. There's been a lot of high-quality distribution from them on the floor. And so in the game for the Bulls, MP is out there with DeMar DeRozan. Then there's Zach Levine. And then it's Goran Dragic. And it's Drummond in at the center position. Here's Collins. Drummond grabs the miss. For Chicago, they've gone three of five since the beginning of the second. 
And when John Collins takes off from the floor, you can feel your hair start to stand up. One of the most explosive players in the league with this incredible liftoff. A strong step to the rim, and he can demolish anything in his path. Simply an electric player at times. MP, no good. I'll tell you what, I think he thought that was going in. I sure did. Now approaching two minutes of action here in the second. Now here's Young. There's the triple. Rebound by the Bulls. Drummond's got four rebounds now. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they've rebounded the ball tremendously well. MP, the pass to Dragic. MP finds Dragic. Cash. It's MP picking up the assist. Dragic has got five points now in the quarter. So it's Atlanta now, trailing by 19. They host the Pistons after this one. It's game three of a trifecta at home. Here's Bogdanovich. Oh, the Hawks again cannot hit it. Yeah, he's kicking himself. No defenders to be found in that mid-range area. Now Young with a steal. Thanks. Well, MP in their last game against the Heat got the job done. He dropped 19 points, and his offensive IQ led to intelligent shots. He was extremely efficient. He was hot once again. We'll see if the defense tonight can do anything to slow him down. Guys? Great report there, Allie. It was obvious he could do anything he wanted. A fantastic win. Well, I'll tell you, he was enjoying himself out there, kind of like us here in the broadcast booth. And whoever was matched up against him wasn't enjoying themselves. What I like is they just kept calling his number. Sometimes we see coaches go away from what's working, and we wonder why. Now here's MP. Pass to Dragic. Back to MP. Hits the layup after the sweet pump fake to freeze the D. MP's got 11 points. He drops yet another dime, just facilitating this offense like a maestro. Murray passes to Bogdanovich. Here's Collins. And he banks in the layup. Keeping that play alive. Anytime a shot. Chicago. So it's Chicago, ending the period up by a... Talk about an unselfish superstar. And now let's look back on that first half of... Thanks as always. We've seen a lot of coaches make the transition from college to the NBA. Smitty, what are the biggest challenges in making that leap, you think? I think gaining trust from your players is totally different from the NBA in college. Also, the pace of the game. Not the speed of the players, but the flow of gameplay itself. And finding the soft spot in an NBA defense is much harder than it is in college. Young runs point with Murray at the two. Collins plays the four with Capella at the five. And it's Griffin in at the three. So that's the Hawks five. Now here's Griffin. He's been productive, averaging just over seven points a game. They really have a commanding lead, not just in points, but in rebounds as well. Yep, that one goes. Levine. Levine's got four points now in the quarter. You know, it really helps your team when you take good shots. Zach Levine making an effort. Pass to Capella. To the inside. The kick out to Griffin. Puts it up from 12. They grab their own miss. Young with it. Guarded now by Ball. Murray with it. Six on the shot clock. From the high post, he drills it. Murray's got this first bucket of the night. Put the first three misses behind them and finally ended their third quarter drought. And Clint Capella takes pride in his defense. He knows what he's on the floor for. He will never back down from a challenge and doesn't take plays off. Terrific game plan coming out of halftime. A perfect three for three from the field. Collins outside. 
Young against Ball. Screen by Capella. Here's Young. And it's Capella with the jam. An intimidator himself. Capella's not shying away from a little contact. Ball finds MP. Vucevic, a screen on Griffin. Here's MP. Gets it. He's 6 for 10 and looking confident out there. And with Capella in his defense, he's a vocal leader on that end of the floor, Greg. Well, he will hold guys accountable in the locker room. Capella knows it takes five committed players to play great defense, and he wants everyone on his team to buy in. And so it's Atlanta with it after the basket by Chicago. Young misses. Hey, the struggle is real. He hasn't found much success with his offense today. MP, the pass to DeRozan. MP against Capella. MP, that one's good. MP's got four points this quarter. <laughs> They're just taking what the defense gives them. And right now, that's the interior. Pass to Collins. To the middle. And a nice finish on the layup. Collins has got his second basket of the night. An active interior presence. 6'10", John Collins keeps improving and keeps impressing. MP, the pass to DeRozan. And it's good. Through contact. A minute 53 left to play in the fourth quarter. Holiday against Caruso. Grant, when you see players make that leap from star to superstar, think about guys like Giannis and Jason Tatum. I mean, what is that step like? You did it. Well, it's interesting. You know, you come into the league and, and, and you have success right away. But at some point, everything just clicks. It could be year four, year five, year six, usually in that window where now you figure things out and now you take that next step and become elite. Now, B.A., you know, I'm hoping that things start to click with me and my golf game. It's been about four or five years there, too. Superstar status is not in the cards for you. <laughs> and so in the game for the Bulls, Goran Dragic is out there with Alex Caruso. Then it's MP, then it's Javante Green, and it's Drummond in at center, filling out the middle. And let's face it, this one was never really in question. They came out with purpose and just overwhelmed the opposition. A great win for the Bulls. A pair of tremendous rebounding teams. And these guys played a little harder tonight, and that was the edge they needed. And you look at their record after tonight. Substitution on the course. And they've had their fingerprints all over this series, winning two straight and looking like they have this team's number. And even the opposing fans can't deny this was a sensational game for Nikola Vucevic. The scoring effort from him, unreal. Carrying this team, I mean, he was amazing tonight. MP shot is good. Ugh, leaving nothing to chance. This run shutting the door on them. Not messing around at all. They were focused, relentless, and they got the job done. Now here's Rondo. Outside Bogdanovich. Sure, from three-point range. When Bogdan is set in the corner, feed him. He loves those shots. Can make him in his sleep. Dragic up top. Checked by Rondo. Dragic outside. So it's the Bulls winning this one. That's the end of the game. As always, thank you to everyone who came out tonight to support it.
So we're coming to the end of my YouTube video right now, so give a thumbs up button if you like the video so much. Click on that bell button to subscribe for more content, and if you saw the recent video interesting, share the comment right below the description so you can share some thoughts and feelings with everybody in the community and make them feel welcome. So I make a happy Corona 95. You all have a great day, and peace out.